In Isaiah 40, verse 22, it says, It is he who sits above the circle of the earth, and its inhabitants are like grasshoppers, who stretches out the heavens like a curtain and spreads them like a tent to dwell in, who brings princes to nothing and makes the rulers of the earth as emptiness. Scarcely are they planted, scarcely sown, scarcely has their stem taken root in the earth when he blows on them and they wither, and the tempest carries them off like stubble. To whom then will you compare me that I should be like him, says the Holy One. God, the Bible says it's he who sits above the vault of the earth, and I, and I want you to think, do you really believe that? Think about this. Think about what your life would look like if you really believed that right now there's a God who sits above the vault of the earth and whose inhabitants are like grasshoppers. I start thinking, okay, if I really believe that, that I'm just a little speck on this planet and there's a being sitting above the vault of the earth who's looking down and it says, you can take any of the rulers and he merely blows on them and they wither. If I really believe that, then why do I do anything other than pray? You know what I mean? Like, like, like really, what, what determines whether or not Cornerstone flourishes in the next 10 years or not? God. That's it. Wait, is it up to this guy? Is it a, no, no, it's just up to God. And, and this whole idea of the rulers of the earth, he says, they barely get to that powerful point. And God says, don't you understand? I would just blow on them and they would wither. It's not about the rulers. They don't determine what happens on the earth. God does. And he sits above this earth. And, and to think about, if I really believe that, what would my prayer life look like? And wouldn't, be there, wouldn't there be a lot less of the stress, anxiety, and trying to work this out, and more and more of just this time of prayer, saying, God, amazingly, by the blood of Jesus, I get to come before you, and here's what I'm asking for. Bring glory to yourself.